Before we get into the video, people, I'm giving away 11,500 Apex coins every single month. To be in the chance of winning them, make sure you are subbed to this channel, have that bell notification button ticked, drop a like on the video, and leave a comment down below. More details are in the video description. What is going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel, and I appreciate you being here. Today, I bring you another Apex Legends video, and today, guys, I want to talk about dragons, aka flyers. Now, if you've watched the latest Apex Legends Battle Pass trailer, which we saw last night, you may have noticed, uh, if you are eagle-eyed like me, something very strange towards the end of the trailer. Check it out on screen now. So, okay, did you initially see those? Well, if you did, you might be wondering why on earth are they? Well, I have the answer for you guys. Okay, so these are what many people are calling dragons, but they're actually known or called flyers. And these flyers are actually something Titanfall fans will be very familiar with, as within Titanfall is where we first saw these flyers. Here is a little more information on them. Flyers are large creatures around the same size as a titan that possess six limbs. Four of these limbs are wings that allow the creature to fly through the air at great heights and speeds. The creature also possesses large tusks on their head just below the mouth. They can be often seen trailing or soaring around creatures known as the leviathans, latching onto them, acting as parasites. The flyers are vicious enough to have no qualms about engaging fully armed squads of infantry and carrying away entire humans, ripping apart advanced IMC aircraft and ripping through armoured vehicles. So that's what we know about these flyers. The Leviathan, if you didn't know, are those giant creatures we see in the background of King's Canyon 2, by the way. Them sort of big looking tree dog rock things. Those are Leviathans. So the question is, why are these flyers within the trailer? Why within the trailer do they look to be directly impacting the game? What are we missing? Now there have been numerous game modes leaked and data mined in the past. Modes which are believed to be hold titans, or vehicles and more. These could also be a part of said modes. Or they could be something completely new to come. Now if that was the case and there is more to these flyers than just this trailer, surely data miners will have found something on them. Well, people, they have. Recently added with the latest update we got yesterday, we see in-game renders of these creatures which you can see on screen now, thanks to Shrugto, whose Twitter can be found linked within the video description. So this render is definitely that of an in-game render, meaning at some point I do believe we will see these in-game. And there are more too. This image via Apex Leaks News, whose Twitter can also be found linked within the video description, shows another image of one of these flyers. We also have in-game coding for these flyers too, new with this latest update. So these have been added into the game files. And I could understand if we were just to see them flying around the sky as well, plane, but we actually don't see anything on them in-game at the moment, which leads me to believe they haven't been activated to appear yet, which could be a part of an update to come. But it's weird though how they tease these within the trailer if they don't plan on these just being some sort of non-interactive creature. I mean, I'd expect uh, sooner or later we will see them maybe as part of a evolving map, just like what we see with Fortnite, maybe towards the end of season one, these flares and maybe other things will evolve the map uh, we love and change it drastically for season two. Or they will be a part of a new mode in which we have seen plenty data mine from solos, yours, 24 and 24 titans and more people. But at the moment, we just ain't sure. One thing I will add though, and even though it's concept art, official concept art that is, we see Octane seems to be fighting one of these flyers. Seriously interesting, it makes you think of the thought process going into creating artwork such as this. So is there more to these flyers than just roaming the skies? Will they be interactive? Will they not be? I don't know, but if any more information drops, guys, I will have you covered right here on my channel, that is for sure. But on that note, we have come to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed it, leaving a like really does help out. If you are new around here and this is what you want to see more of, be sure to subscribe. If you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.